Hi, this is Helen Schnell. I'm Helen. I'm going to walk you very quickly today through the 1991P Chanel catalog. If you're lucky enough to have some of this, it'll give you some information maybe you didn't know. And if you don't have any 91P, you might run across some, and this will give you hints as to what to look for and what not. It's, it's, uh, it's one of these collections that sometimes has the long hang tag. They call it the paper tag. And sometimes it has the short satin tag. Nothing's consistent with Chanel. First thing I'll show you is the cover. That lets you know there's lots of color in this collection. We don't see that so much today, but it comes and goes. This item I'm showing you because it has grow grain ribbon trim. Okay. And it's a piece you see from time to time. And if you see a piece with grow grain ribbon, generally it's faded. So be looking for that. I mean, this thing is 28 years old, so it might be faded. And if it is, it's not quite so pretty anymore. This, by the way, is not the 91P. This is a 99, can't remember, maybe 99A. And I'm wearing it just because I like it. Too tight across here. The girls don't fit, but this is okay. So that's what you do if you get one that's too tight across the top. You just button up the rest of it. Here's some of the color. Yellow. Notice there's no, no shoulder seams there. You might want to look out for that. And Chanel's yellow, really yellow. So be ready for that. There, today's world, you can wear that. But, you know, yellow is one of these colors that comes and goes. Sometimes it's in, sometimes it's not. Here's some of the just gowns, perfect even for today. That's the amazing thing about Chanel. If you can wear it yesterday, you can wear it tomorrow, you can wear it today. A lot of black and white, even though this is a collection that has lots of color, it still has lots of black and white too. Here's a suit. Now you see the suit, the skirt is very short. This was the era of mini skirts. But you can get this suit when you find it, not necessarily with this short a skirt. It's still wearable. This one has just been altered for the, um, for the photo shoot. But what you need to notice about this one, I will try and bring it in some for you, and that is the buttons. The buttons are off center. And um, that is that way by design. But I point it out to you because you don't want to buy this and then have someone say, you know, you've actually buttoned your coat up wrong. No, that's how they are. That's it's uh, that's the way it came. So be aware of that. Don't let that throw you off if you like. It came in a lot of different colors, too. Here's another one. This is pretty in pink. It has a very short skirt that's gathered at the waist. And guess what? Almost always the shirt is short. So if you're going to look for this outfit with a longer skirt, don't waste your time. It also has, you can see the jewelry is very big. See the pearl earrings? Very big, very attractive. What you need to know about that is that if you find some pearl earrings, and these are really in now, all these older, large clip-on earrings, the, um, if they have pearls, they're, they're usually chipped. So look very carefully. And it's not a real pearl. I mean, who's got a pearl that size? But it's a thing that Chanel did, and they coated it with this beautiful coating that made it look like pearl, but it does chip. Sometimes it matters, sometimes it doesn't. It scratches, too. Uh, I think I have one on my website that is, um, has the pearl, and there's a chip out of each earring, but it doesn't seem to show when you wear it. Maybe it's the placement. I'm not sure. Of course, the price is much reduced. But I would never, ever put anything weird without um, an explanation. So you'll, you won't ever buy anything from me and get a surprise like chipped earrings. I'll tell you ahead of time. Here's another one. This was a popular suit. Uh, it has the grow grain trim here, which is going to be faded. And this particular suit almost always has faded shoulders. I can't really tell you why, but I mean, I've sold everything in this catalog. I don't know how many times. And that, that often happens with this particular suit. Notice there's a hat that goes with the outfit. Very often the hats are not even produced. The hats, some of the accessories, they're just for the photo shoot. But this particular one, I believe, I've never seen it, but I believe that it is offered for sale somewhere. I'll show you why in a minute. Just more color and more huge earrings, which is great. Both those things are great. Here's another suit. It has a very short skirt, but it's one you see pretty often. It's very pretty, but it also almost always has faded shoulders. 
by faded, I mean the fabric color has faded on the shoulders. Usually you see that if something's been in a store window or something and the sun gets on. I don't know why it happens with this particular outfit and the other one with the grow grain trim. I'm not sure, but that's the only way I've ever seen it. And by the way, I'll show you one more thing about this one. And that is, you can't see it, even if I pull the film in, uh, the video in, but it has buttons that are fabric. And the fabric is grow grain also. And then it has this sort of figure eight-ish design on it that does not say CC. But the fabric of the buttons is the same as the trim. So just so you know that, you don't be thinking that something, somebody's trying to pull so, something over on you. Um, here we are again. You'll always see black and white with Chanel. Uh, recently, it's more black than white, but that's the way it is. Here we go with the colors. And I'll show you something else with these colors. Oversized. That year, there were oversized shirts. That's not a mistake. That's the way it is. And it is... Um, it's probably a size 4 or 6. A size 12 can wear this with no problem. They're huge. But that's how they were that year. I'm not everyone, but a lot of them. Here's another. The gowns, beautiful colors. I've sold these gowns, and they fit beautifully, and they're just as wonderful today as they were then. I love the colors. I love the colors. Here's the hat. This is what makes me want to tell you that this hat, it was probably produced for sale. Otherwise, they wouldn't have a whole picture with just the hat. It was used as an accessory in one of the other pictures, and I believe it was also for sale. The problem is, of course, this album has things that are 28 years old, and the chance of those feathers staying pretty and frisky like they are, pretty slim. But you never know with Chanel. Sometimes people buy Chanel, they put it in their closet for 28 years or however many years. They bring it out, it's like new. So there we go. Always, always look. Be positive. Here's some shoes, okay? Those shoes you could wear today, they're just sling back. They have a jeweled buckle, and they have a heel that's not offensive, okay? Just a regular short shoe heel. Do you know many designers that can give you a shoe in 1991, and you can still wear it in 2019 what, or whenever? That would be Chanel for you. Colors, big jewelry, colored jewelry, lots of it big jewelry. Here's another piece. I'm, I'm showing you this one. I've shown it before because I happen to have one of these pieces. This one right here, sorry for my price tag, is the same as this one right here. That's poured glass. That's stone. I'll bring it up here so you can see it a little better. I don't want to... That's poured glass and it's done in several colors. It's a system that Chanel uses that nobody else is able to pull off. And it is, um, makes a gorgeous stone. We, we still sell it today. It's still in the jewelry today, the new stuff. So um, that may be, that's the end of my walkthrough, 1991P. And if you have any questions, you can always reach me at hc20850 at aol.com. Always glad to talk to you about Chanel or anything else. Talk to you later. Bye.